Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Lauren and if you're new here, welcome. Today I will be talking about a few ways to help you get out of your funk. And not just like a bad day funk, but like a funk that you've been in for a while, a standstill funk, maybe for a week or a month, or maybe it's like a season of your life. Maybe you feel bored in life, maybe you feel like your life is just on autopilot, maybe you have like zero motivation to do anything. In my experience, there are a few steps that you can take in order to get yourself out of a funk. And hopefully these steps can be tools that you use in different parts and different times of your life when you feel like you're in a funk. First of all, check your relationships. As humans, we are deeply desiring, we constantly want an authentic connection with other humans. So are your friends truly your friends? Are you in toxic relationships? Are the people you are surrounding yourself with are they the kind of people that you are aspiring to be? Are they helping you become the person that you want to be? Consider joining a like-minded group, whether it's a vegan activism group, or it's a Bible study, or it's a hiking group, or it's a workout group, or a workout buddy. Do something for somebody else. Shout out to my mother who always told me this growing up. Whenever I was feeling depressed or anxious or felt like I was really down, she would suggest that I would do something for somebody else. I'd get out of my own way instead of just thinking about myself and feeling bad for myself I would do something for somebody in need whether it's going to volunteer at a local shelter or it's as simple as going out of your way and cleaning the house or cleaning the kitchen for your partner or your roommate or your parents or your family or whoever it is or maybe you could just write a really nice letter to your co-worker do something crazy like seriously crazy like walk backwards all day or wear crazy makeup or if you can do it go see skydiving, be daring, be adventurous, do something that's totally out of the ordinary for you. Do something totally odd and don't think about it. Don't over plan, don't make it too serious, just do something weird. Change an outward appearance of some sort. If you've been dying to change your hair, change your hair. If you've been really wanting to get a tattoo, get the tattoo. If you want to get a piercing, get the piercing. You get the picture. Go out or don't. So depending on your personality, if you are somebody who likes to be at home, who's a homebody, who likes to just chill out, watch Netflix, just be hanging out by yourself, then consider saying yes to more things. Consider going out more, even if it's something you're not totally interested in. Just get out of your comfort zone and go to the local events that are happening around you. See what's out there. And if you're somebody who is always saying yes, why don't you like chill out for a second? Maybe just say no to a couple things and let yourself recharge at home and just be okay with saying no a couple times or a few times just to let yourself recharge. Write it out. Seriously, I mean, I know it may sound cliche, but writing it out actually is really helpful because most of the time our brain already has the answer. We already know why it is we are feeling like we're in a funk. Or sometimes our brain can give us little roadmaps as to why, and when we write it out, our brain and our heart and our emotions kind of have to talk to each other because it's our emotions or sometimes our ego that doesn't allow us to recognize the answers that we already know. So write out why you think you may be in a funk. Maybe list a couple things that have been really just bugging you or annoying you or getting you down. Whether it's going to the grocery store is really annoying and I hate doing it and it's overwhelming. Write a couple things down to see how that can change for you. Maybe utilize a delivery system. There's lots of those out there. Or maybe you're dealing with something maybe a little bigger than that. Maybe something is toxic in your relationships or maybe it's a friendship that you just gotta let die. Write down a couple ways to possibly resolve some of those issues or cut ties. Go on a weekend getaway and don't think about work, don't think about obligations, don't think about anything. Just get away and chill out. Get inspired by reading books, by listening to podcasts, by watching YouTube videos that are inspiring to you. Get into your really inspired, motivational things by just listening to people and what they have to say, whether by books, podcasts, YouTube, or even really cool movies. Rethink your goals. Are your goals the same as they were six months ago, a year ago, two years ago? Have you changed? Have your goals changed? Has your life calling changed? That's all okay, but sometimes we get so overwhelmed because we are reaching for and we're trying to make happen the goals that we made a long time ago that aren't even a part of who we are anymore. Lastly, something to think about. If you have been in a funk for a long time and you really feel like you just can't break out of it, consider maybe talking to somebody about it, whether it's a friend or maybe professionally because 
If you feel like you've really been in a really long season of dark funk, it could be mild depression or anxiety and it's something worth talking to somebody about. So those are just a few ways to possibly help if you're ever in a funk. And if you've ever been in a funk, how did you get out of it? Was it a bunch of little things? Was it one big step in your life? Let me know down below. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below with your tips and tricks. Subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time.